Hey guys, I'm Rival. Welcome back to the channel. An exciting day today. You see on the screen, we get this is awesome series two packs. Therefore, we get new cards. We get two 99 overalls as our collection set reward Batista and Sami Zayn. So, here in the video, we got to take a look at every single card that did release. We got some live events out, some upcoming ones we'll take a look at as well. But first, the pack market. How much are these suckers going for? The exact same as Chaos. Nothing changed. 24.1 MFP or 16.5 there. We have 35.1 or 18.5 for the deluxe. And then the boxes. That 20 box, 702,000 my faction points or 370k for the VC. And our 10 box. This one I'm probably doing on Sunday. 351,000 my faction points. I will pay for that. I think I might do that. Hmm, hold on. Let's take a look at the pack odds. So for the basic pack, 3% chance for a pink diamond. For the deluxe, a 5%. Honestly, hmm. What if I did, what, what if on Sunday I did a basic 10 box of This Is Awesome and a basic of Chaos? I might do that instead. We'll see. I say that's going to be the video on Sunday. Just a heads up, tomorrow I am opening a bunch of packs. This came from all of those live events. I still have to do the one-on-three handicap match. That's why I have not opened these. After I get this video up and going live, getting that done, and I'm going to open all of these packs on the live stream today. But if you don't catch the live stream, you'll see it as a video tomorrow. All right, let's take a look inside of this pack. We got 98 overall pink diamonds for Carmella and Triple H. We get 97 EO Sky, 96 Damian Priest, and then our diamonds down here. 94 is Umberto, British Bulldog, 92 is Grayson Waller, Ludwig Kaiser, and then we got 90s for Braun Breaker, Luke Gallows, Nathan Frazier, R-Truth, and then there are the Amethyst cards. Then we take a peek inside of the collection. What do you need for the Sami Zayn? You need two pink diamonds and three diamonds. That Triple H looks amazing. We'll take a look at him in a second. And then for the 99 Batista, Eo Sky, Damian Priest, and then three diamonds there. All right, let's start with the 99s. These cards look gross. We take a look at the badges. Oh, the magical trio. Merciless opportunist. Sting like a be heavy handed, all top tier. Also a top tier for Rabble Rouser, Slippery Eel. Awesome looking card, man. Tier 3 Space Invader makes it even better. He's got a Rage. And then Tier 1's for all we see a coming in Lionheart. His attributes, 95's on Arm and Leg Power. 95 on Grapple Offense. 90 Running Offense. 90 on the Power Submission Offense. 80 on the Technical. 95 Body Durability. Maxed out 99 Leg Durability. Maxed out 99 for Finisher Special. Insane looking card. Jeez. We take a look at the 99 pink diamond, Sami Zayn. This one... Ooh. He doesn't have heavy handed, I guess. Only a tier 2 on Merciless, but that's that's still really good. Top tier on second win, going in hot, pain train, rabble rouser, sting like a bee, all we see it coming. He's got a tier 2 energetic opportunist as well. Tier 1 wet blanket. Amazing looking badges here. Something he has that Batista does not have is that top tier, all we see it coming. I love that badge. Although... Batista does have a tier one. Sami Zayn having that top tier just makes him insane. You take a look at his attributes. Of course, you know, these, these are going to look incredible for a 99, right? 90s on arm and leg power. 95 running offense. What else here? We got, whoa, 99s on the strike and grapple reversal. 90 on the technical submission offense. 80 on the power. 80s really good for the power. Gosh. Go all the way down. Really nice here. We got 99 pin escape. <laughs> 90 on the strength and stamina and agility and movement speed. 95 recovery. 99 on special and finisher. Whoa. Now we hop inside of the pack. We'll take a look at all of these cards. I'll try and fly through these. We'll start with the 98 pink diamond Carmella, a striker. Awesome looking card. That is my favorite class. And she's got the magical trio as well. My favorite badge in the game, Merciless Opportunist. My second favorite sting like a bee. She's also got heavy handed. Heavy handed, you can argue, is just as important as sting like a bee. She's also got second wind, space invader, quick climber. Attributes looking as so here. Lots of good numbers. Look at all the... <laughs> Look at all those 99s there. Pin escape, stamina, agility, movement speed, recovery, special, finisher. Unreal. We take a look at Triple H here. His badges. Thing like it be heavy-handed, merciless, weapon master. Love to see that. Extreme rule matches, no DQs. 
uh weapon master is insane tier two wet blanket i'm saying insane a lot because guess what it's all insane <laughs> we got 95s on the arm and leg power 95 on the grapple 85 running offense 74 is on the power and technical other attributes looking as so awesome 99 special finisher we move on eo sky a high flyer another one would sting like it'd be merciless and heavy-handed incredible we take a look at her attributes she's gonna be very quick very good at aerial and her attributes reflect that yes we move on damian priest another striker here and another one would sting like it'd be heavy-handed and merciless wow 95 on the arm and grapple his attributes looking pretty good as well we move on those are all of the pink diamonds we got a diamond british bulldog sting like be heavy handed top tier top tier pain train tier two for the merciless but still very very important that he has that he's got an 88 power submission offense love that british bulldog cards in this game very good if you have not used them check them out we got a umberto here his moveset very fun to use badges attributes He's going to be very quick. You see down there, 99's agility, movement speed, recovery, 96 stamina. Recovery and stamina, very important. We move on, Grayson Waller, a striker. Really fun card to use as well. I like his Amethyst, Danger Zone 2 card a lot. He's got tier 3, Sting Like It Be Heavy-Handed, Merciless, Top Tier, Determination, Pain Train. And then his attributes are looking as so there. We move on, Ludwig Kaiser. He gets a 92 overall diamond. Wet blanket, very nice to see. Stunning an opponent with an attack reduces their special and finisher stock. Love to see that. Got a tier 3 thing like a bee. There are his attributes. A Bron, a breaker. Love his pink diamond. His 90 overall diamond here. Top tier sticking together. Sting like a bee space invader. He also has a tier 3 slippery eel. We got a 90 on the arm, 76 only on the leg power, 85 grapple offense. All right, we move on. It's an okay looking card. Nothing stood out too much on that. Next up, Luke Gallows. Top tier, better together. Sting like a bee. Pain train tier two heavy handed. 70 on the power. Like power submission offense. If you see a 70, I think that's good for power submission offense, honestly. Other attributes looking as so. Next up, Nathan Frazier. Trying to fly through here. If I'm going a little too quick, just make sure to pause. His attributes, boom. Next up, our truth A striker. Rabble Rouser, love to see it. Swiftness, Pain Train, Tier 3, Sting Like a Bee. His attributes, boom. Nice recovery. We move down. Now we move on to the Amethyst cards. JC Jane. It's an 89 overall Amethyst. Again, Weapon Master, really good badge in those no DQs, those extreme rule matches. Weapon Master, Weapon Master, Weapon Master. Keep it in mind. For attributes. Doing everything he can to fit in the Judgment Day, man. <laughs> Damian Priest hates him. His badges, his attributes. Very quick. We move on, Katana Chance. Probably going to be a very quick card here as well. Top tier, yeah. Top tier, Quick Climber Swiftness. She's got a Merciless and Sting Like a Bee. Only a tier 2, but that's good. That's good to see for a high flyer card too. Wow. Her attributes, yeah, very quick. 99 speed, 97 agility. We move on. Cameron Grimes. Now, this one is very important to get. You'll see why in a moment. You need him for a live event. So, if you open up packs, this is the guy you want. Elton Prince. Pretty dangerous. Badges, attributes. 80 on the technical, love to see that. We have Akira, a student in the Alpha Academy right now. He kind of fits in, he's funny, man. Badges, attributes. Very quick here as well, 99s on agility and movement speed. 94, stamina, recovery, love to see that. I like pointing out that recovery and stamina because sometimes I'm sitting there, maybe in a longer match. As we look at Ashante the Adonis here. Uh, maybe it's a longer match. And the stamina and recovery just not very good. They get winded. And it's very, very annoying. Because you can't swing. Because you can't strike as fast. You can't move as fast. You can't run. Very annoying if those attributes are lower. We take a look at Jim the Anvil Neidhart. His badges. 
and his attributes. He looks cool in that pick, man. I like that pick. All right, guys, let's move on to the last and final thing we'll cover in the video, the live events. Again, um, when was that? Wednesday. On Wednesday, I grinded through all of these. And I'm going to open those packs on tomorrow's video because I have not done this one yet. From this one, I get a Deluxe fast lane, Signature Series, and then Basic Decorated and Payback. So I do want to open all of those at once. This, oh, this, 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 this put me in a bad mood. <laughs> the live stream is posted. It was difficult. I personally used Money in the Bank Cross. That was my guy. I failed a few times before finding Cross, but once I did, um, I don't... I don't want to say it was easy, but it was easier. It was easier. Now, this one went live. Money in the Bank EO Sky to unlock Sonya Deville. Just a one and done. This one, a one and done as well. I do not have the Cameron Grimes. I'm going to open This Is Awesome Packs on Sunday. Uh, I will open one to end the video, but, you know, that 10 box I'm going to do on Sunday. And that is it. Go to the upcoming tab. Now, you... Need a Rowdy Rowdy Piper here. So, yes, you got to get Cameron Grimes to get him. Domino Effect again. So, if you can't get him, you will not be able to get Pink Diamond. Johnny Gargano. So, hopefully, I can get Cameron Grimes. We go down to this one. I do have Maurice. I will get Sonya Deville. And I will unlock a Pink Diamond Queen Zelina. Just a one and done here. Very excited for that. I hope her badges are totally awesome. We go down to this one. JD McDonough. This is awesome. You get him. You get a 98 overall Nathan Frazier. I did not see this one. I don't know if this one just popped up or what, but that's pretty cool. And then down here, a one-on-one, one-on-one, -on -one, and 5,000. My faction points for both one and duns. This one does have packs attached. All right. Uh, that is everything. No faction war, ladder update. Nope. Not yet, guys. It's coming soon. <laughs> Jeez. All right, let's go to the pack market. What am I doing here? What am I doing here? Should I do... I'm going to do a basic, man. The pack odds are so bad for this. A 5 and a 26. I understand it's a 77 for an Amethyst. But, I mean, a 69 is just as pathetic in my mind. So, I'm going to do a basic pack. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to smash that thumbs up, smash that thumbs up to put me over. Drop a comment below. How did your packs go? Subscribe if you're new. I got a 94 British Bulldog. I will take that. I was worried I'd get a stupid amethyst. That's not Cameron Grimes. All right. Again, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Smash that thumbs up. Drop a comment below. Subscribe if you are new. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Video tomorrow. Live event packs. 24 of them. And then any Neon Horizon packs I pick up in Faction Wars, I will go ahead and open as well. So maybe 25 to 30 packs being opened on Saturday's video. And then on Sunday, I'm going to do a 10 box of these new packs. This is awesome series two. Hopefully they're totally awesome. And then I will also try to do a 10 box of Chaos. Because I want that pink diamond lily, to be honest. So, see you guys there. Peace out.